Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Curing Electromagnetic Hypersensitivity. And we're here to look into this experiment that we're starting today with the Diphenbachia. So this is a Diphenbachia plant and it's going to be light deprived. So we're going to put it into a very dark closet where there's no light. And we're going to see what happens to it. And I can tell you what has happened to the three previous Diefenbachias that I've put into a very dark closet. And that is, they lose their leaves. So all the leaves are gonna disappear in the space of a month. And all you're gonna be left with is the stem structure. And the stem structure goes brilliant white, it loses all the chlorophyll. And then if you bring it back out into the light, it will start regrowing and it will go back to being green, but it doesn't grow like this. It grows in a different format, much smaller leaves. It never recovers the patterning in the leaves, nor the large size of the leaves. So because I've done this experiment three times before, we're going to add in another variable, and that is this. So this is an Electrofan sound machine and it has a number of settings. We're going to use it on the lowest pitch white noise setting. And we're going to put it into the cupboard with this plant because I've been noticing in plant experiments in my home that if you fill the home with noise, plants that are showing chlorophyll stress start producing green chlorophyll and the leaves go back to looking like this. And it's an interesting effect and it also appears to occur in the human because I actually noticed during the period of that experiment regarding the noise filled house and the regreening of the leaves that my energy levels increased and I also had my vitamin D tested and that had also gone up. So there was two very definite things that I noticed in my health during the period of the sound experiment. So I'm curious to see if this plant will follow the dropping of the leaves and all the stems going white or whether it is actually able to retain some of the green chlorophyll in its leaves and its stem structure if we put it in to a dark closet with a sound machine. So that is the experiment. And as soon as I have an update, I will do another video. I hope you enjoyed this video and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.